She's gonna get it on. Okay, today we're at the space and we have to do interviews, but we got a couple cool things in the mail. So one, the roaster is supposed to come today, but two, what's already here are espresso machines. One and two. Okay, we're gonna have one machine for traditional espresso, and then the second machine we're actually gonna use to brew by the cup coffee. So that's like a bit of a quirky thing that we're gonna roll with, and we'll talk about that later. Tanner's here. I'm here. With that live in, or might not even need to. Just missed the delivery truck, but what we have back here is two huge crates. One with a coffee roaster in it, one with an afterburner in it. Damn! Los is gonna have this thing done in what, five minutes? What's your estimation? Two minutes. Two minutes. What do you think, Chair? The unveiling. It's gonna be real. Oh shit, it's all wrapped in plastic. Uh oh, about to drop the hammer. I know you're busy, but you have to come look at this. It's not optional. This thing is like that car that you've seen pictures of that you know is sick and you want to get it, but then when you see it in person, it's like eight times as sick as you thought it was. We got a variable speed fan plus the damper. We got variable drum speed. It's just messed up. Jeez, this is... Woo! Look at this thing, are you kidding me? Afterburner. We got the roaster in, but now we gotta get three feet on either side for ADA and make sure the positioning is. What? Bueno. What is this? This doesn't change anything. Gas line coming all the way through, turning the corner, but that goes to that, goes to that. Oh, it could drop straight down would be yeah, sick. Be, yeah, because you want to want to maintain this. Yeah. But having more work area back there kind of makes it better. Yeah, yeah, there it is. We still have to bolt it down, but we're gonna put it together anyway, even though we're gonna have to take it back apart because we want to see it. Yep. Bearing tool. I'm 100% 50-50 on all of this. Yeah. Control yeah. panel is on. Okay, we got the roaster in. Can't take a full picture of it because we can't open those back doors or the front doors because they're painting so the whole garage door is taped off. So it looks a little, you know, it's a little low light but we're dialed in. Maybe one of the best days of my life, I don't know. How do you feel, Jer? <laughs> This is the first day of my life. Yeah, dude, we got the door, drop batches into the cooling tray here. It looks nice, it's roasting cool at the same time. At the same time. Got our tryer right here. Load it, load it. The side plate is sick. The face plate is sick too. The detail on the face plate is like amazing. Control panel, couple little Magna Helix here. After burner, Jared Truby. Once we get those doors open, it's gonna be sick. I take the pan, I'm, can we just fucking open these things? Back home, showered, did a bunch of interviews today. Got the roaster all set up. We still need to punch a hole through the roof and plumb the gas line in, but it's in the building and it's all together, which is pretty incredible. Uh, shout out to Nico, Simon, and Carlos, because as you can tell by watching the video, I didn't really move the thing too much. I was kind of a guilty bystander hanging out, taking pictures. So the construction crew definitely did the bulk of the heavy lifting, which they didn't have to do. So thank you so much. But the roaster looks beautiful. The color is Poseidon green, and then the rest is powder coated raw steel. I've used an older San Franciscan before, but this newer one has a bunch of different features on it that I'm really excited to dig in and play with. Didn't get a chance to uncreate the espresso machines. I think they kind of just would have been in the way of the whole thing, so we'll have to do another unboxing with those. Really good day overall. We got our biggest piece of equipment delivered. It's incredibly sexy, and we're just really excited. And I'm really tired, and I have to open in the morning at the bake shop. It's my last day there. So I'm gonna get to bed and I'll see you guys soon. Peace.